Today, the world's dumbest teacher, which is me, is going to be teaching the world's dumbest students. I have a feeling there's not going to be much learning today. What is going on, TFG Squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome to Teacher Simulator. So right now, I need to pick my teacher. I guess I'll go with the guy because I'm going to be the teacher today. All right, here we go. Ask the class. How does that work? All right, so this is a lot like Papers Grade Please, if you remember that game I played a while ago where, you know, my teachers or my students were very dumb. This is very similar to that game. All right, let's, uh, let's just go in order. What does this kid have to say? Which animal is pink? A cow. Okay, see, now this is showing you that it's not my fault. It's their fault. And that's what every good teacher says. They, uh, a good teacher never blames themselves when a student struggles. They blame the student and say that the student's dumb. I mean, no, a cow is not pink. And if a cow is pink, there's something wrong with that cow. So, no, we're going to say no. Sit down. You're dumb. And uh, just try learning better. All right, here we go. Next kid. Next kid in line. A flamingo. That's a wonderful answer. Right now, they're giving me the answers, but... As the game goes on, I will be picking my own answers. But yes, a flamingo is pink. Moving on to the... Uh, oh, a new question, new question. What does LOL stand for? It's a weird thing to teach a, a class, but you know what? That's fine. Let's go with the girl in the back. Laugh out loud. Well done. Well done. My class went two for three. I went three for three as a teacher. And I got a standard salary of $134. I mean, that's not that bad for the day. That is not that bad for one lesson. $133. Yeah, thank you. Moving on to the next lesson. What are we doing now? Uh, cat? Why am I? Okay. Yeah, I'll give that a check. Oh, oh, I see. I see. So they drew a cat and then wrote cat. Then they drew a dog. For some reason, they wrote hippo, and then they wrote, uh, drew an elephant and wrote elephant. Okay, okay, I get it. So basically, I need to learn how to grade papers, too. I've never been a teacher in my life, although both of my parents were teachers. So maybe I have a little bit of skill in my, in my blood. I don't, I don't know. All right, moving on. Cabbage. No, that's a carrot, you dummy. Uh, car. Yeah, that's a car. Beans. No, that's pizza, you dummy. Go sit down. Go sit down, especially if you don't know pizza. How could you be? I mean, these look like high school students, right? Like these don't look like little, uh, you know, first or second graders. How does a high school student not know what pizza is? Also, how does a high school student not know what a lion is? No, that's not a sheep, a fish. Yeah, that one's right. And then we've got the Eiffel Tower. That is correct. How do you know the Eiffel Tower, but you don't know what a lion is? I mean, that's embarrassing. That's really embarrassing. All right, I had another perfect day. And I got another $134. And yes, you guys ask me every day. I still have my cold. I think I might just be sick for the rest of my life. It, I guess it's just something I will have to deal with. All right, so I unlocked a new game. Uh, hall monitoring. Okay, so now I am a teacher and a hall monitor. Okay, why not? Why not? Let's tap to start. Best offer? What? TV and film. Oh, that sounds good. Oh, I'm choosing what class I want to teach now. So general knowledge teaches or pays me 76 to 91 dollars. The film class could give me up to 136 dollars or I could teach about food. It only gives me 50 bucks, but I love food. I'm taking the job. <laughs> I'm taking the job. Sharpen pencils. Doesn't seem like part of my job. Okay, how much am I sharpening it? Okay, that wasn't perfect. Boom, and... Okay, I thought I just had to hold it until they told me the pencil was done. That's why I got one of those little guys now. But that's fine. Monitoring the halls. All right, here we go. Uh... I don't know what this kid's doing, but he looks like he's up to no good. It says he shared his crayons. That's good. He respected his teachers. That's good. And he flicked ink. Uh, I don't feel like that's a very big deal. I'll let him go. That was wrong. Uh, he had to go to the principal's office for flicking ink. All right, here we go. What is this kid up to? Uh, fired spitballs at kids. Was disruptive in canteen and smashed a window. Yeah, that's, uh, that is definitely going to the principal's office. Get into the principal's office. And what are these two people doing? Oh, they're fighting. They're fighting. They're absolutely fighting. All right, we're going to... 
either let her go, stun her, or spray her with a fire extinguisher. Yeah, let's go with the fire extinguisher. Seems like the best way to handle bullying in the hallways. Here we go. Yeah! Oh my gosh, how long am I gonna... <laughs> how long am I gonna douse the girl in fire extinguisher fluid? All right, there we go. I did a good job. Made $57. Good to know that teacher salaries are still very low in this game. I like it to be very accurate to real life. All right, wonderful. Next class, uh, draw an orange. I guess that's an orange, right? No, but the oranges don't have the thing sticking out the top. This one's kind of tough. I feel like that's supposed to be, I feel like that kid was trying to draw an apple. I'm gonna say no, but that was an orange? I've never seen an orange with a freaking leaf coming out the top of it. Have you? I'm upset with that. Strawberry. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Strawberry is one of my favorite fruit. Love it. Well done. I don't know why. Also, wait, why is this a class for high school students? Why are we teaching them basic fruit? Could you imagine in high school if you had a test that just said draw an apple? And that was the entire test. That was it. It was one question. I guess these are the world's dumbest students, so that might make more sense. All right, no, that's not a pineapple. 54 more dollars for me, and I unlocked a new outfit. Okay, I, I don't want that. I don't want to look like a football player as a teacher. I feel like the students are just going to make fun of me. All right, that was the end of the day. I can get a new game. What is it going to be? This is going to be like a special one. Exam supervising. Okay, apparently they don't pay me enough that I can just do my normal job. I need to take on other jobs. Uh, sports, uh, TV, film, or business. Let's go sports. I love sports and it pays the highest. Here we go, moving on. All right, she drew a tennis ball. That's correct. Cycling, that's correct. Ah, oh, you were so close. You even knew what the tennis ball was but you didn't know how to draw a tennis player. Wrong. Am I ever gonna get a student that gets three for three? Am I ever gonna get a student that goes three for three? I don't know if it's possible. I don't know if it's possible even if I become a good teacher. Well, we're already off to a bad start here. She thinks a ballerina is a weightlifter. No, I didn't wanna say yes. Wrong. Basketball, that's correct. Pool ball, that's correct. All right. Hey, you know what? My students are getting better. My students are getting better. They're getting two out of every three right, which isn't bad. And we've got bowling ball, no. Soccer ball, yes. Tennis, yes. Again, two out of three is not bad. I think that was the end of the day. So what do I get? 140 bucks. Wait, what can I spend this money on? There's got to be something that I could spend this money on. All right, you know what? I got to find the cheaters. Oh, there's one. There's one. How do I, how do I click on him? Right there. Cheating. Cheating. Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here, you bozo. All right, uh, oh, she's cheating, she's cheating, she's cheating, she's cheating, got her! Get out of my classroom, you failed! You will always be a failure! Oh, there we go, oh my gosh, all of these kids are just cheating off of each other. There's like one kid that's actually legitimately filling out his test here. Look how happy I am after a hard day's work! Well done, me! Why is that the new outfit I unlocked? No, no, I don't want to look like that. Everybody's just gonna make fun of me. All right, next class. General knowledge, business, food. Tempted to do food again, but let's go business this time. I'm a little confused with the, um... Oh no, the pencil sharpening part. That should be good. Not sure, okay, great, great. The first one I did was not very sharp. That one's perfect, even though it's like one inch long and will last never. And that one's nearly there. Ah, uh, great, great. I, 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 I'm so dumb, I don't even know how to sharpen pencils. What kind of teacher doesn't know how to sharpen pencils? I already stink. All right, what is the currency in Germany? Ooh, I think it's the Euro, right? Isn't that the Euro? Dollars, wrong. Sit down, everybody laugh at her. Next in line, Euros, yes, that's correct. All right, I'm actually proud of myself for knowing that one. All right, what does the company Samsung make? They make electronics, musical instruments. I don't think Samsung came out with like a Samsung tuba. You know, I don't think so, that's wrong. Everybody laugh at Gerald. All right, next one, fast food. You think Samsung makes fast food? Okay, that was even worse than instruments. No, sit down. 
Uh, what about this guy in the back? Tech. Yes, that's correct. That is correct. It's embarrassing. Honestly, I'm surprised they didn't know that. You would think high school students would know technology better than anybody else in the world. What did Henry Ford sell millions of? Oh boy, I'm afraid to ask. Guitars? No. No, 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 no. Next. You better say cars. There it is. There it is. There's my guy redeeming himself from last week. Who founded Microsoft? That would be uh, William Gates. No, it wasn't Donnie. Wasn't Donnie. What about Bill Gates? There we go. Okay. Okay. My students are getting a little better. Let me know if I should come back and try to make these the world's smartest students. Also, check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. And I will see all of you in the next video. Oh,